So I'm going to clean my sewing machine and I actually already started and I, I should have recorded when I first started, but I didn't. So I just want to show you, first of all, um, I have cleaned the inside of this with this tiny little, I don't know if you can see it there, but it's like a tiny little um, micro brush and that's a new one. So you can see, you know, <laughs> there was quite a bit of dust on there. Um, you can get these in different kinds. This is a Tooltron brand. This one here comes in yellow, pink, and blue, and that is from Quilt in a Day. So I basically just go around in here, clean all the little crevices out, and I stick it in as far as I can. Oh, there's some more there. See, I got some more. So I just like take it off with my fingers. Um, but I did get most of this and, and I got quite a bit. But one thing I want to show you is this brush here. Oh my gosh, I love these brushes. It is so soft and yeah, it kind of looks like a makeup brush, but it's not. It's a it's a sewing machine cleaning brush. And I literally just, I jam it in here and just kind of wiggle it around. And look at all the, the fuzz that comes off. I don't, can you see that? Look at all the fuzz that comes, that was in there that I didn't get. And then I just like kind of shake it off, off to the side. And yeah, so I recommend doing this part with this brush. There's not too much there because I actually got most of it already. Um, but I just wanted to show you how well these, these brushes work. They're amazing. I love these brushes. So, um, but yes, it is a sewing machine maintenance time. So I always like to clean it once in a while. And I don't know if you can see, but right in the center, right in here, it looks like a little piece of fabric and that's the wick. And that needs oiling every now and then, just a drop or two, not very much, just a drop or two. Don't ever try to pick that out because that needs to be in there. So uh, yeah, so. Happy cleaning. Don't forget to do it.